So I think you'll see a couple of trends impacting the markets this year. One is rising bandwidth requirements associated with market data feeds. Uh, Opera, for instance, in the U.S. is now consistently over 10 gig. Uh, you need to have the right infrastructure in place to be able to support that sort of thing. We're seeing the same trends impacting markets globally. Uh, Eurex is getting higher, uh, same with ICE in Basildon. Uh, and this is something that we're starting to see more and more of and firms need to be prepared for. We're seeing an increasingly complex web of exchanges being weaved together as part of global trading strategies today. And that's very difficult for firms to be able to make sense of all the data and also to be able to get access to all of these various markets. We're seeing increasing adoption of ultra low latency technologies, things like layer one switching and FPGA. These are things that were more of a niche solution in the past, but we're now finding that this is increasingly becoming a requirement to be able to operate in some of these markets globally. So the first way is through simplifying the exchange onboarding process. For example, at TNS, we'll walk you through every single step in the process, starting with the initial paperwork sign-on, all the way through to getting entitlements. We'll facilitate conversations with the exchanges, and we'll make sure that it's a smooth, simple process for you. Another way we can simplify market access is by making it easy to trade on more than one market. Oftentimes, firms need to connect to more than one exchange as part of their trading strategy, and we can facilitate that very easily through one connection into TNS. One connection to TNS gives you access to our entire global network of exchanges, covering most major markets and many of the smaller markets. Another way TNS can simplify access to markets is by managing your infrastructure in the exchange co-locations. Things like racking and stacking servers, setting up your networks, putting in place low latency switches. These are all things TNS has a great deal of experience with and can manage, especially in markets like Asia and throughout Europe and the US. Another way TNS can simplify access to markets is through connectivity. Firms need to get set up with connections to a variety of financial institutions as well as vendors in addition to markets. TNS has a financial network of over 700 financial institutions and we can manage all this connectivity through one simple connection into TNS.